Hi my beautiful Capricorn, welcome to my channel See the V. Thank you to all of you that have been supporting my channel. I'm grateful and thankful. I'm sending lots of love, blessing and prosperity your way. This is a general love reading. It won't resonate with everyone. If this reading is not resonate with you, please check out your other breath chart placement for more clarity. Take what resonates and leave the rest. This reading is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus and Jupiter. Thank you, God. Thank you, universe, universal energies, ancestors, spirit, guy, archangels, ascended masters, the pure white light. Please give my lovely Capricorn a clear, precise, honest message for the highest good. This is for the month of November. This is your monthly, so it is a love reading, but whatever that comes out, comes out. Okay, copy? So if you guys are new to the channel, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the like button for me. I appreciate that. And if you are returning subscribers, welcome back. I love you guys. Oh, eight of cups is at the bottom. So we're going to check on the energy and on your energy who is coming towards you. What is the message you have for Capricorn spirit? What is the message you have for Capricorn Healings begin six. So we have the six of swords here. So you guys might be doing some healing works. You guys might focus on moving into calm water, into peaceful resolution here, into some type of peaceful and calmness. But I feel like you guys are trying to start healings, your heart chakra and your um and your wood chakra here. What other message you have for Capricorn? Two of Pentacles. So yeah, you guys could be definite. I feel like you guys are definitely try to heal. You guys might be tired. I feel like you guys might be overworked also. You guys could be, some of you could be boss, leader, manager. I feel like you guys might be like exhausting, overwork yourself with this two of pentacles here. Because I feel like you need to find balance. You need to go get some rest. You need to go rejuvenate here. Uh, recuperate it. That's what I'm feeling here with this um, healings begins in five balance because you guys might need uh, overwork yourself. Show me the mess um, energy of the person. So you could have a Leo that's coming towards you guys or you guys could be dealing with a Leo. But I feel there's something that's going to whomever this person is. There's something that's coming to clarity for you guys coming together. So this person is coming towards you guys. They want some type of you guys might have like a, a loving connection, a beautiful connection here. But there's something is going to be illuminated. You guys are going to find some type of clarity. There's clarity that's coming to this and stuff when it's come to this person you guys might find out also with the sun here someone is very they are in the masculine energy but someone might also find out that they are pregnant for some of you this is a message for not a lot of you i'm feeling here with this but i feel like someone here felt like the last time we get together and stuff like that there were or someone could be just worried they might be pregnant yeah we have the four of um uh, Four of Wands at the bottom, joy and stability. I feel like someone is overjoyed about something um, they are celebrating. So whomever you are dealing with, there's some type of celebration that's going on. Here someone is overjoyed. I'm hearing that I'm coming out. So whatever this is, you know, um, this person is fine and stuff like that. It's going to be some type of truth and clarity that's going to bring you to some type of balance. Yeah, like I say, finance and career. So you guys could be definitely, I feel like you guys are focused on your finance in the month of November. You guys, like I say, you guys could be have a lot going on, like especially if you're a manager, um, if you're a manager, if you are a boss here, um, CEO, COO, whatever. I feel like you guys got a lot of work going on here uh, for you guys. You guys are not even focused on relationship playfulness. So, uh, but I feel like there's someone that's coming towards you guys with a playful energy. You guys might be in the that energy like, you know what, I'm just here to have fun. I don't want nothing committed. I don't want nothing serious. But 
a past life relationship. There's someone from your past. You have known each other before. There's someone from your past that's coming towards you guys. You're going to feel like you know this person. Message for this person that Capricorn is dealing with. You deserve love. Yeah, someone in here extremely happy. If you guys are flirting, you guys are having fun with someone, they're going to feel like they want more than that. Give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. I feel like, you know, this person is being encouraged, encouraged here, encourages to give this connection a chance to work on this connection and stuff like that. Someone in here felt like they deserve love. They want more than friendship. You guys might offer someone from friendship. You guys might have this bond, this strong bond, friendship with, with the two of cups and stuff. You guys might feel like you just want to be friends. This person might feel like they want to be more than friends. That's what I'm feeling here for you guys. And chemistry is at the bottom. Yeah, you guys could have very great chemistry with someone. A very strong connection, magnetic attraction for someone here. But you guys like, I just want to be friends. <laughs> I got I got a lot going on at work. I don't want no commitment. I feel like that's your main focus for November. You guys are focused on work while the person that's coming towards you is focused on a connection. They focus yeah they want to tell you something this person is extremely happy ecstatic when it's come to you they're very happy when it's come to you so but you guys like no thank you i can be your friends but i don't know if i can give anything else that's a good thing i like the honesty on that capricorn that's beautiful if you guys can be honest with yourself, be honest with someone, that's a good thing. Instead of lead them on. Page of Cups. But you might getting some message that, that you cannot refuse. You might getting some type of message here. Ooh, the devil in the Page of Cups. Okay. Yeah, very sweet. A message that is sweet. Someone in here might find you very, very attractive. Or this is... You Capricorn, that's fine. Someone very attracted here with the devil and the page of cups. This is you. That might send somebody very sweet, delicious message. <laughs> okay. Sh show me the energy of the person Capricorn is going to deal with. We have the king, the uh, knight of cups. This is flu in a reverse. I felt like whomever this person here that's coming towards you, they might want to come and give you guys some type of love offer that let's go have drinks, let's go out, have fun. Someone sees you as very single, very attractive here with the Knight of Pentacles, very attractive, very... This, this person sees you guys might be a workaholic, so they want to offer you something, but I feel like this person is undecided because they might see you very well off in abundance already. Hey, I'm telling you, the devil. Look at Capricorn, like, this is my reading. I'm letting this person know how I feel. Someone in here is find you very, very alluring, very attractive in the month of November. They cannot resist. Someone find you irresistible, Capricorn. Oh, buddy. Mm-hmm. This person, whomever this person is, there could be, like I say, it could be a Leo. Someone find you very irresistible here. Show me the energy of the person Capricorn is dealing with. Yeah, Ten of Cups. Mm -hmm. Someone, in, like I say, this is someone that is very happy. They want family. They want some type of blissful contentment here. But I felt like six of pentacles. They want the reciprocate. They want balance. They want giving and receiving here. Whomever you are dealing with. Ten of swords. So there's some type of ending. Someone is walking away from type of ending. This ending could mean 
anything, any thought process, any drama, any chaos. This person could be walking away from them, but this person is fine. You very alluring, very attractive, very sexy Capricorn. Okay, okay, Capi. Show me the energy of Capricorn. Two of Swords. You're like, I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> Two of Swords. For some of you, you could be like, nope, that's not going to happen. Like I say, you want friends with benefits. You don't want nothing serious. Knight of Wands and a reverse and stuff like that. I feel like you guys doesn't want anything serious here. You just want friends. You want to, you know, you want to do you. See your reading. Yep. Being, you've been very truthful and honest with someone here. You don't mind, you know, if they're going to give it, you're going to take. If they're going to give whatever they want to give, whether it's time, whether it's intimate, you're going to be with them and stuff like that. But you don't want nothing seriously. With the Two of Swords, with the Two of Swords, you have this, you try to, um, you have a decision to make here. I feel like you have some type of decision to make. You are being truthful. You are being honest. You are telling this person how you feel, what you want, what you don't want message for Capricorn Knight of Pentacles yeah you guys are walking away from uh, a situation because you guys are main focus on your work partnership business wise things like that you your guys are main focuses on your work on the month of November justice okay Capricorn so you're getting some type of justice. You're getting some type of justice. You feel like whatever this is and stuff, justice served for you. Knight of Pentacles and justice. You could be, um, there could be a Libra on your vicinity or on your energy. Nine of Swords. Someone could be very much in despair. So you could see this person very much in their head in despair, having sleepless night and stuff like that because this person might be dealing with the justice system but i felt like some type of truth and clarity is gonna come to this the chariot here so you guys are going to move forward let me see more yeah two of pentacles yeah move forwards being victory having balance and stuff and there's gonna be the tower there's gonna be a tower moment in the sun yeah there's going to be some type of realization when it's come to this person you are dealing with when it's come to this leo i feel like there's going to be some type of tower moment there's going to be like Sorry, copy the reading cut off, but let's clarify to see what's going on with your reading. Okay, I don't feel like to go we do a whole reading over again. So let's clarify justice cards. Can you please clarify the justice spirit for Capricorn? So wow, okay. The temperance. Someone need to find balance because someone in here is, has a lot of worry. So, so someone in here is definitely stressed out, worry about the justice system. Like I said, someone could be worried about like they're not getting some type of justice. But I felt like they felt this because we have the Nine of Swords here twice. Nine of Swords, Nine of Swords. So someone in here definitely worry about that. They're not, uh, if they're dealing with the justice system, whomever you are dealing with, someone in here is worried. Whomever this person that's coming towards you on the matter of um, of November, they worry about the justice system. There's, they're really, really, really in their head having sleepless night, having nightmare despair here. But I felt like there's going to be balance. You know, there's going to be balance. This person will be able to move into peaceful uh, peace. Uh, they'll, be, they'll be able to move into peaceful harmony and peace here. So there's, this person going to be okay. But I feel like it's, this is they're just worried for no reason. I feel like things is going to work out. They're going to get justice served in their favor here. You could be dealing with Sagittarius, but... Whomever this person you are dealing with, they are really worried about something here. They have a nightmare, sleepless night. They are in despair regarding the justice system. Clarify the Knight of Swords. I want to know what is this person is worried about. So we have the Queen of Cups and the Knight of Wands. So I felt like someone in here might be worried that they've been, you know, 
whatever this person is worried about, it's unfounded because I felt like with the night of one here, someone worried that they might be um, getting locked up or something like that. You know, you could be dealing with someone that's worried about that because nine of one here, this someone in here could be, this could be a guard and stuff like that. Someone could feel like that, but I feel like this is unfounded. With the Queen of Cups, someone in here is very intuitive. They use their intuition, but they, at the moment and stuff like that, this person could be close their, um, they be the intuition is closed off and blocked off. That's what I'm feeling. I'm just just felt like someone intuition, they very intuitive, a cancerian you could be dealing with. But I feel like someone is very intuitive. The emotion is black at the current moment. That's what I'm feeling here. So I don't see anything why is this person is worried. Clarify the knight of wands. Clarify the knight of wands, please. The Sagittarius energy. Yeah, page of cups. This person could have been rejected. Someone message could have been rejected. I feel like someone in here felt like rejected. There's a message and stuff like that. Someone gets some type of message, send a message, and they didn't receive the message well, or they didn't get the message. They just didn't, didn't care for the message. Period. I feel like someone don't don't care for an apology either. Someone here, um, you could be, dealing, like I said, it could be a Sagittarius. Someone doesn't care about an apology. They don't care. They just, this is someone that, they are, this is ignorance and stuff like that. That's what I'm feeling here. Someone really don't care about this message at all. Clarify the Ace of Swords. So we have the seven of wands, seven of wands and the knight of pentacles. There's there's an offer that's going to come towards someone here. There could be spiritual blockages. There could be someone could be fe feeling very defensive. There's someone you are, whomever you are dealing with, whomever that's coming towards you, this person is very guarded, very defensive and stuff. When it's come to open up, to receive here, to receive, they're very blacked up. They will, but they, you are going to tell this person the truth and stuff. Like you might even try to tell this person about themselves. That's what I'm feeling here. Not in a bad way when I say that, because I feel like you want to offer this person something, but they are very blacked up there because they worry about the justice system. But this is someone that find you very attractive. This person find you irresistible, very sexy, very attractive, but they are very blacked off and close off. They are very defensive. That's what I'm feeling here. This person could have been went through a lot, especially with the nine of wands here. This person might went through battles. They went through a lot of breakup. A lot of people disappoint this person. A lot of people backstab. Might be, you know, uh, <clears throat> treat this person so wrong and stuff like that. They're feeling defensive uh, when people come and talk with them. It's very hard for them to open up their feelings. That's what I'm feeling here. Clarify the Ten of Swords because, yeah, like I said, Ten of Cups. So someone in here was very happy. I feel like you could have been dealing with someone that is very happy, but they were betrayed by their own family. So the I feel like the betrayal was done by their family if all the betrayal is going to be happened by their own family. That's what I'm feeling here. Whatever this betrayal, it's happened because of their family. We have the Ten of Cups here and the Ten of Cups here twice. So whatever this betrayal, but it's over. It's done with. I feel like this is this is over and done with. This person will be able to move into a peaceful environment, a, a much more um, time. They'll be able to have some good time. Clarify the uh, clarify the devil. Yeah, secret. Like I said, secretly, this person find you very irresistible. We have two major, three major arcana, the death card, the high priestess, and the devil. So, like I said, someone in here, very intuitive. This person could be in the occult. This is someone that is transformed. You know, they transform their lives. I feel like this is someone that want change. The, whatever this person is doing, they want to change, they want to transform, but secretly and stuff, this person find you very irresistible. Clever the Knight of Cups.
Knight of Cups, clarified Knight of Cups. Yeah, this person is definitely coming towards you to give you an offer. They want to give you an offer. They even want to give, you know, for some of you, you're getting some type of apology here for whatever that ending that happened. Um, if you guys was talking, you guys were friends, this it something ended abruptly. Someone want to offer you guys an apology. They want to offer you guys like, let's get together, let's be together. That's what I'm feeling here. But this person been through so many uh, endings, so many heartbreak, so many backstab and stuff like that. They afraid. I feel like this person might be afraid of commitment, but that's what they really want. Six of Pentacles. They want balance. They want giving and receiving. But I feel like this person is single, well off, in abundance. They, they, you know, I feel like this person is not sad or anything. They just went through a lot. They just went through a lot with people. Clarify the Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, this person focus on their work. They focus on their work instead, you know, instead of anything else. And focus on their love themselves. Focus on their work. Focus on their loving themselves. That's what I'm feeling here. They give the love to themselves and pretty much are uh, busy working. Clarify the Ten of Cups. Clarify the Ten of Cups, please. They might have holding themselves back. They could be, you know, they could be an employer involved. They could be someone that is very in control. They could be, I feel like this person might be dealing with someone that is very controlling. I don't feel like the emperor is you. I feel like someone in here might be dealing with someone that is very controlling. That is like try to hold them back. That is try to hold this person back. But I feel like things is going to work out. They're gonna, this person is going to get some type of justice here. Because guess what? They are spiritual. They have been spiritual guided. I feel like spirit is say they're going to be okay. They have nothing to worry about here. Things is going to work in this person's favor. They are going to get some type of justice here. So whatever this is and stuff like that, justice is going to serve for them. They really have nothing to worry about here. This betrayal, it's already over. I feel like the betrayal is done and over with because we have Ten of Cups, Ten of Swords, and the Ten of Cups again. So if this fam family betrayed this person, this is she, he or she can put this behind them. I feel like there's no more. Things is going to work out here for this. See, Five of Swords, Nine of Swords. Yeah, like I said, this is some, you know, there could be some air sign that is very immature that you know that is this person could have been doing this because they're envious this person could have been dealing there could be an air sign that is a part of this shenanigan betrayal backstabbing and stuff like that because this person is envious i feel like someone in here that's very immature too Let me see what this person want to tell you, Capricorn, before I close out your reading. We need to talk about everything. Yeah, this is. I feel like someone is here very honest. They don't. They close off because people hurt them. You are my two of cups. You are my soulmate. When you see this person, when you met this person, if you haven't met them, that's how you're gonna feel. You're gonna feel like you know this person before, and you're gonna feel like you know each other before. I try to. I tried to replace you, then I realized that you are irreplaceable, and now you are gone. So, I don't know, you might have met this person, like I said, briefly, and then the connection ended. That's because this person been through a lot of heartache, a lot of sadness, a lot of breakup. People just really treat this person so bad and stuff like that, so they don't know how to... They don't know how to behave. They don't know how to be in connection and stuff. But there's this person really want to have a connection here. So what's coming in November for you, what's coming in November, this person find you very attractive. They secretly want to be with you, but due to whatever and stuff like that, it's going to be, you know, it might be a little bit of challenging, but I feel like things is going to work out. Everybody's going to be in their place because this person is being spiritual, spiritually guided and spiritually protected here. They are getting justice. So there's nothing to worry about here. You guys could move towards, move 
forward with this commitment with this relationship whatever you want strengthening guidance yeah so you guys are really this this going this connection it's gonna take off if you guys decide to work on it see expect miracles if you guys chose to work on this connection together it will work out but that's a step to you if you chose to all right capricorn that's all i have for you for the month of november um, I love you guys. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share the video. Bye, Cappy.